Meanwhile, the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Peter Obi, plans to redesign the Nigerian bulk electricity trade in the NBED to make the Nigerian electricity market efficient. The party notes that electricity flows in one direction to the consumer, but the cash does not flow back upstream to all those who have participated in creating the electricity. The Labour Party dropped this hint earlier today during a panel session on par on the global fundraiser Telethon for the Obidati campaign tagged the final push. Energy and power expert Jerome Okolo gave a breakdown of this during the session. The manifesto is um, offering to redesign MBET to be the efficient ele electricity market that takes charge of all the funds coming in and then therefore the, the distribution of money within the Nigeria electricity system will then be on a non-recourse basis. It will not be dependent on the uh, discos sending money upstream uh, to other participants, but the money will come into a pool and based on the contracts that have already been agreed by, um, by NERC, the money will go to the discos for their work, the transmission company for sending the electricity around the country, and then to the generators, and then to the suppliers of feedstock like gas. And then it also will, have, will be able to cope with the new generation coming in from uh, the renewables, the solar power, the wind power, the wave power. Um, when you have a system that ensures that once you put power into the system, you will get money back without having to go to anybody's office, without having to beg anybody. Also, Director, Center for Public Policy and Research, Dr. Sam Amadi, gave an insight of what effective regulation can do for the power sector. Effective regulation would mean that the power regulator ensures that money flows back to the uh, power director and straight to the gas supplier. So misalignment is one aspect of it. The second aspect is that, look, the reason why we have problems with electricity is that unlike telecom, which is plug and play, electricity has so many values, value chains, and each of these value chains must operate at a certain level of efficiency. So if, for example, the discos we have to today are very difficult to implement change management and therefore maybe meet their customers, recover all the revenue, Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.